Facebook, what's going on? She got Professor Smell Good coming to you guys live. How you doing, Miss? Straight out of Detroit. I know that's right. Yeah. Coming to you guys live here at my shop, selling the Shane East Lafayette inside of the Family Fair Marketplace. All right. I'm going to talk about today. Um, I have so many ideas down. I have so many ideas in my mind so many times. I have to actually write this stuff down on paper. I have to write the titles down on paper because my mind be flowing with different topics to actually touch upon, and sometimes I may forget it. All right, so what are we going to talk about today? Hmm. Okay. Don't wait too long. Don't wait too long what? What exactly are you talking about? Don't wait too long to buy the inventory. I'm, I'm going to talk about that too. I'm going to talk about that too, but not right now. Don't wait too long to actually get a logo. Don't wait too long to actually uh, be professional. What exactly are you talking about? Don't wait too long. I'm talking about people um, that have been knowing you for years and they see that you embark on this endeavor of selling oils or being successful or trying to be successful, entrepreneur, etc. And they see that you are on the edge of being successful but they're envious, and so as a result, they won't support you to make it seem like, you know what, you're not doing anything good, or you you ain't doing nothing, so why would I support you, right? But when you actually become successful, free samples of the oil. Hey, don't let me. Can I give you guys a free sample of my oil for you one second? No, I didn't buy stuff from being that son. Okay, so what about this right here then? This is the whipped shea butter right here. Now, wait, wait, give me a sample. And what that melts right in the skin. That's the soft version of the shape. But ooh, so soft it made you jump. <laughs> so soft it made you jump. Hey, you How's it going? You alright today? Right. It's my friend. There you go. Hey, hey baby, how you doing? You alright? <laughs> you did okay? Hey. Yeah, okay. Hey, I'm okay. Okay. I'm gonna do something for Okay. Let's see. Okay. Well, I just want to. Okay. Well, I just want to introduce you to us so you, I keep you updated on what I have. And it melts right through your skin. And it made you smile too because before you was coming, you you wasn't smiling, but soon you rubbed it in and smiled from here to here. Have a great one. Oh yeah, got the whip shake butter man too. And it's it's going like hotcakes, man. It's it's going like hotcakes. Okay. All right. Anyway. So, um, people that actually know people that sell oils or anything being successful, whatever endeavor that is, there is, don't wait too long to actually root for the person, okay? If you're sincere, if you know that that's your friend, somebody you grew up with, they're doing the right thing, they've been an entrepreneur, root them on from the time, root them on from the time that they actually make the decision that they want to be an entrepreneur. From the time that, you know, they started, from the time they actually, you know, battling with, you know, sales going up and down to the point where they be, get up there and become successful. You be in the whole process rooting for them. And you know what's going to happen as a result? Because there's going to be a reward for you. There is, there will be a reward for you. When they finally get up there, you know what's going to happen? They're going to say, you know what? Such and such. You know what? You were the one that actually rooted for me. I bought you a house. I got your BMW. I got your Benz. I got your Lexus. 2017. You know, that's what that's the reward. That's the reward for rooting for the person. Okay, so that's that's what normally happens. So when you root for the person, got something new. Got something new. So that's what happens when you root for them. All right now. So when you root for them like that, this is the way of them saying thank you, because perhaps you were the one that actually. Help them to stay mentally afloat, you know, to actually get to the point where they're successful. So don't wait until they become successful and actually start rooting for them. No, you root for them the time that they make decisions to be an entrepreneur. And when they become successful, they're going to most definitely reward you. So it's your guy, Professor Smellgood, coming to you guys live at my shop. Seven the shame is like that. Thank you.